Just don't laugh like that. Hey, no, wait a minute. That's not very nice. Yeah, come on. Nuns want it, too. Yeah, what if she's a bikini nun? You ever think about that? It's insensitive. You horny boy. Good for you, Penguin. I won't interrupt. Do you think that those three do it? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. He pays them a lot of money. And his nose? A lot of pros with that nose. <laughs> All right. What? Black mask dead. No. I'm on my way there now. All right, fine. Can, Can I leave? The audio? Yes, of course. We will check in with Pangu later. All right. Hey, so let's check out the uh, Dark Knight challenges we have to do because these things are annoying and we have to do them throughout the game. There is no doubt. Let's see. So we got a counter in the middle of a beat. You oh. can do that easy. What's the next one? We'll move on. Yeah, yeah. Easy. Uh, no, not. Oh, over, I see. Over, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Got the protector. Stop a crime in progress. Easy. Come on. We'll do easy. that when we go outside. Challenge us. What's this? Use a sun. Come no on. Problem. Okay, we have to do that three times. And that one is That's just problem. beating the game, basically. Finding stuff. Yeah. Let's get out of here, then. So we need to go All through right. here. Have you notice how every game we play, we have to check the map every five seconds? <laughs> no. Well, we're scarred from Resident Evil. That's all we did. claw I took from Deathstroke could be useful here. Indeed. Could be, but it won't be. I don't think we're going to use it, though. I'm going to head out. It just so. seems impractical. Uh, this right. game is so pretty. It is, yeah, the, because you upgraded it, dude. Your PC makes this game look fantastic. Yeah, it it doesn't look very good on the original Xbox 360. No, and that's the thing, is like it was amazing back then. It was fun. But this is such an upgrade, dude. I'm so glad you did this. It's like a brand new game, honestly, compared to what we were playing with on the 360. Well, people ask me, will we get a remaster? Honestly... All they gotta do is port the PC version. You don't need a remaster. No, absolutely not. Port that over and let us enjoy it on the PS5. Yeah, just but lock it at 60 FPS. Oh, who's this? Your cries for help have been heard. I am Anarchy, voice of the people, here to save you from the plague of corruption that now infests this once proud city. Those hired and elected to keep us free and safe won't lift a finger. And why would they? They've been bought and paid for, encouraged to turn a blind eye. If they won't act, I will. At dawn's first light, the sources of Gotham's ruin will be destroyed. Now, back to your regularly scheduled programming of propaganda and consumerist garbage. As if there isn't enough going on tonight. So here's the question. Is anarchy wrong? Oof. Getting into the heavy stuff. Yeah. I love it. Good. I mean, because think about that. All the corruption in Gotham. Bought and paid for. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is he wrong sure. in wanting to restart? I mean, forcibly, Ooh. but restart. Yeah, yeah. So, like, blow everything up. Yeah. You start from scratch. Yeah. Now, bad way to go about it, but... Yeah, yeah. It kind of has a point. What do you think? Uh, I think this city is pretty much beyond saving, but Batman is known for trying to save it. Even if it's Ooh, way hey. beyond saving. Wait. I was hoping to get a minute of your time. Oh, you can. I'm so sorry. That's on me. I have a story to tell you about crime and violence, greed and vengeance. But it's also a story of redemption, of second chances, of change. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I believe in choice. So I offer you one. Let them detonate or stop them. Your actions will determine what I do with you. Hey, mister, over here. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption... Whoa, whoa, easy now. I ain't looking for a fight. Got a message, that's all. Anarchy says if you're gonna make a withdrawal, you better do it soon. I offer you one. What? Okay, so we gotta go to the bank. Okay, here we go, 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 go. Uh, is that sign on the uh, on the map there? Is that telling us where to go, right? Yes. Excellent. That's the A for Anarchy. Ooh, fantastic. All right. You bet you it. didn't think you were uh, playing the game with the Count from uh, Sesame Street, <laughs> did you? <laughs> what a gift. Did you watch Sesame Street? I didn't a lot, to be honest with you, though. Huh. I did go to a, uh, a play once where they were singing and dancing. A and Sesame a Street crowd. play? It was a cesspool of children, and I was in there. Didn't even want to be there, to be honest with you, but I had a good time. Why were you hanging out with kids? Uh, well, my dad brought me there, so really you should ask my dad why he wanted to hang out with kids. 
Uh, I think I'll be texting him later. That's probably important. And ask him that. where the play is. Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's a good call. You should do that. Okay, so we need to go up hey, and around. What happens to this big thing in Arkham City? Or No, wait, we're on the other side of the wall. That's why you don't see that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're I had right. to think about it. Yes. Because only part of this ends up being Arkham City. Yeah, uh, not a lot of it makes it. Well, uh, amusement, amusement Mile makes it, right? Yeah. Is that in here? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's been so long. Also, if you see a crime scene on our way, we have to stop one anyway, so you might as well. Here okay. you can do the beatdown during, like, the counter during a beatdown. Sounds excellent. They say money makes the world go round, but it also makes for excellent shackles. You're tied to your job, your mortgage, your need to buy the next shiny thing your overpriced television produces you. So, are you surprised they didn't put Batman in Mortal Kombat 11 and they put Joker in? No, to be honest, because they really... Well, actually, that's a fair point. Because I was going to say, because they don't really put major characters in the other games, but they put Sub-Zero and um, Scorpion, right? Is that his name? Yeah. They put him in Injustice. So, they both made it. And Raiden. And Raiden, yes! So I was, that was going to be my point, was like, well, they wouldn't really put a major guy like that in there. But it almost makes sense that they would, so I don't it's know. It's Batman, he sells, Yeah, you know? Yeah, that'd be a great DLC. Got a problem. So I saw, this anarchy fellow mentioned three bombs, which means two still remain. I need to find them. I've no doubt you will, sir. Yeah, I really want them uh, to, um, I really want them to expand the, this is off topic. Oh, you can level up. Oh, we should. I really want them to expand, like, the Injustice roster in the next game. Because, like, one thing I'm noticing is, like, they brought Joker into Mortal Kombat, right? Yes. And now they're doing uh, Robocop, which is amazing. I'm super excited for that. That's Couldn't really cool. be more thrilled. Uh, they have Terminator. You know, in MK10, they brought in characters like Jason Voorhees and the Alien. They don't really take those risks with the, with the uh, Injustice roster at all. Like, I mean, we don't get anything really out I was there. The Hellboy. The Ninja Turtles. And the Ninja Turtles. I'm glad yeah. the Ninja Turtles are there. That's fun. Those were cool. Those were really cool. Yeah, I but, agree. like, beyond that, I mean, I didn't care that much that Hellboy made it. No. And, and Spawn should have been in Injustice. Oh, that been a great one, But he yeah. ends up in Mortal Kombat. Oh, he's in Mortal Kombat? Yeah. I didn't know that. I don't know why, but yeah. It's just oh. like, what? You, you know what I mean? Like, what? Who's making those choices? And why are we doing that? Yeah, because Spawn absolutely should have been an injustice. Yeah, that's a no-brainer. It feels like. I don't know, man. I don't know because I and I've heard I haven't really kept up with them at all. But the injustice comics I heard are supposed to be fantastic, and I'd like to check those out and see like the what parts the I've read. They are. You have read some of them? Yeah. Okay. But yeah, no, I'm not like you know up to date on them. Entrenched either. in it. Yeah. It's uh, it's supposed to be. I've heard nothing but good things about it, to be honest. And I'd like to learn like what I'd be missing going into Injustice Three by not reading the comments. The problem, know, the comics, is that they just undo some of that or like write around it. So it's almost like you're missing nothing. So for oh, example, really? uh, Green Arrow was dead in that universe. They wanted to use him again in Injustice 2, so they just brought him on in from another universe. Oh, so it's, that's just their, an easy it, cop -out. It's not that it doesn't matter at all, but it's like they can just bring in whoever they want from somewhere else now. By They've kind of set that precedent. Yeah, you know, so it's... I, I yeah. don't know. I don't know if that's So, like, no one's thing. ever really dead. Like, Joker, for example, right away in Injustice 1. I mean, you see it right away. Dead, but then other Joker's still there. Right. So it just opens up the opportunity the whole time. This crime should have a real yeah, no one's ever really dead in that universe, I suppose. Well, they're dead in that universe, but they're not permanently dead forever, because they can come from somewhere else. Yeah, it's it's complicated. It really is. Right. Take out the oh, coppers. Getting in the flow. How come you never got the Dark Knight Challenge for, like, the uh, counter during a beatdown? Uh, do you have to do more than one? Maybe? Do it slow? Nah, they're too far away. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. There we go. Oof. I'll be at a disadvantage. Sorry, dude. Into the cops communications. I should hack their mobile. Uh, I'm gonna have to go upstairs in a couple them. minutes and get our pizza out of the oven. Cause we're hungry, thick boys. Very true. Rubio, what's your twenty? Yo, Romeo. Yo, oh, Romeo. Give me the good, son. Oh, it's Rubio. Rubio. Oh. Mark Rubio. Marco Rubio. Marco Rubio. He made an appearance. Alex Jones is like, you're not an intellectual. You're freaking a frog. <laughs> You just hear him over the comments. Get back here, coward! 
That was him he said that to, right? Yeah, I think so, yeah. I thought it was, but I wasn't sure. It's such a funny meme. <laughs> he, he was just in the news recently for saying something funny. Do the beatdown. Oh, yeah, good point. All right. Slow. There you go. That Perfect. Should work, but who knows? Yeah, I, uh, if it didn't work, maybe you need to do even more. We can check. Maybe? I'll check right now. Let's Sometimes see. you have to do three of these things, which is dumb. Yeah. Stop grabbing fire right now. Shoot it. Wrong one. I know, it's kind of confusing. Yeah. Wrong one. Oh, it's the first one. I'm an idiot. Get an A grade. Oh, so I did get it. Oh, you oh, did? Okay, we okay, got it. I didn't see it. Awesome. All right. So now we just have to get an A grade in a fight so with what? Do a good job. All right. All right, well, fair enough. Do I go into this door? Yeah, yeah. All right. In through the exit. And we're on our way. Batman's the guy when he sees the indoor and the outdoor, it goes in the outdoor. Oh, what a guy. Alpha move. Doesn't this look great? Oh, dude, it looks so good. Yeah. Like I said, this was such an upgrade from what we did, what, six years ago when this came out? Seven yeah. years ago? It's been so long. 20, was it 2013? I think so. I think it was 2013. Jeez, that cave. I know. <laughs> right through your head. Yeah. Oh, you're at the crime scene now. Dude, one of my favorite parts of the entire game. I remember oh, it's that. it's so experience. good. Penguin murdered Black Mask. But why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. Identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Sionis's girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel, long list of priors, but nothing to indicate she was the target here. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height. But the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room, but these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter, and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. It could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter.
fabric analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. She was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Someone killed Black Mask, but this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The only answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here, or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful, non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea. 